Golden State Warriors. They get their first move on the board here in free agency and sign Otto Porter Jr., former Orlando Magic and Chicago Bull last season. So last season for Porter, a lot of injuries as it's been the last couple of years for him. He just can't stay healthy and on the court, but he got that big contract from the Bulls and he was a totally a bust for that team in Chicago. So last season, 9.7 points a game, 5.4 rebounds, two assists, 1.4 threes a game, 85% from the foul line, and 43% from the field. So Porter, like I mentioned, he didn't play many games. He missed a lot of time. And towards the end of the season, he went to a team in the Orlando Magic that obviously were rebuilding and traded away all the good players. Like Nikola Vukovic was in that deal, obviously. They traded Evan Fournier as well. So this team, every year, seems like they're rebuilding. But now he joins a possible contender in the Golden State Warriors, and we'll see if he's going to play major minutes for this team. There's rumors Andre Iguodala might go back to Golden State. They're also interested in Patty Mills or rumors as well here. But what if they won? It wasn't free agency, and now you're going to see these middle-tier to bench players start signing after most of the big guys are rough. So as far as fantasy basketball goes, we got to see what type of role Otto Porter Jr. is going to play here for the Warriors. I think he's probably going to be a player coming off the bench Unless they lose Kelly Oubre in free agency and Klay Thompson's not going to be 100%, then this guy will have a real role and real fantasy value. But right now, as things are looking, we just got to wait and see what Otto Porter, but he's probably going to be a guy you take in the later rounds with his upside. He's still a very young player, even though the last few seasons have been totally a waste with his injuries and him just not performing at the level he was when he had that big season with the Wizards. So the Warriors here make a move for Otto Porter Jr. We'll see if he can get back on the right track in the upcoming 2021-22 NBA season.